distract me. You know, my mom used to say, I got a little hammer. If you're so too, you understand that. It's hammer. Imagine, all one of us hammer, so I mean, I can't do that. I'm an exam to write. Hi loves, welcome back to my channel. For those who don't know me, I go by the name of Unfiltered Kitty. And if you're new here, definitely subscribe to this Unfiltered Fem Honey. As I always say, Gumnandi Apa Omelendoni. What are you waiting for? Oh, emitting it. Do subscribe so that you can become a member of this Unfiltered Fem Honey. So loves, on today's video, we're actually going to feature Oowami and Ojeki Pamutu. So if you actually follow Oowami and Ojeki Pamutu, you would know the story. You would see there's a drama between them. So apparently, Oowami actually uploaded a video where she was interviewing some girl called Uno. And then Ujeki Pamuz actually watched that video and uh, retaliated on her Instagram and actually put like posted some stories saying good the way oh, oh, I'm actually like uh behave there on that interview Hagai and stuff like that. Then oh, oh I me actually felt offended by Ujeki Pamuz's comment. So we all know that they were friends before, like 2020, 2021 and stuff like that. So they were friends. So Oami like now uh, threatened to actually release some story time with Uti Gwenzagaleni for them to actually have this fallout as a friendship and stuff like that. So okay, like we've been waiting for the video. Instead of making a video, she gave us a 30 minutes long video where she was saying Guti, uh... She was not doing a story time, but she was basically telling us what was telling a story saga, Jackie Pamut, what actually happened between them, but she never uploaded the video. And Tina as a man ninjas and a man ninjas, we obviously waiting for that story time. And oh, I'm is busy making videos regarding that video. And firstly, she actually uploaded a video where she was saying good she, she won't be bullied to actually release that video. She would actually upload it at her own time. So now she's busy making videos, uh, official statements saying good she, she doesn't mind being sued by Ucheki Pamuzi. And trust me, she will release that video whenever she wants to release it. And people should be actually on the watch out saying, good see, anytime that video might drop. Instead of releasing that video, but she's here uh, making statements saying, good see, she's not afraid of Uche Kipamut. And we know Gutsu Uche Kipamut actually went on live saying, good see, she's waiting for that video mainly because of the way OOM is actually behaving. Instead of creating that video or uploading that video so that we can see Uguti Kashle Kashle, like Gwenzagala and between them. Okay, she's busy here making things good. I won't be like threatened to actually release the video. And now she want to release it mainly because of Ucheki Pamut is here making live video saying good. Uh, she will sue her. Like, like, girl, really? Just release the video already. Why are you busy making statements so you, you will release the video? What are you afraid of? I feel like oh, I'm actually the one that is actually afraid. And obviously, there's a reason why Ucheki Pamuz actually said Uguti she will sue her mainly because of she has been hinting a lot Uguti uh, people shouldn't uh, use things on their nose. And obviously, when we look at that uh, comment of her saying Uguti people should stop using things on their nose and stuff like that, it seems like she's basically saying Uguti Ucheki Pamuz is uh, on drugs. Of which we don't know for a fact. But the things that like she has been hitting, obviously, Ujeki Pamut will be like curious. Which, okay, is she saying, which, I'm actually on drugs or stuff like that? For her to actually continue saying, whenever she's talking about Ujeki Pamut, she's telling people to actually stop using things on their nose. And it does seem like Vele, she's basically saying good to who cares is using something. So we've been waiting for that video of which is not coming. Let's just be honest, guys. Even if you are a ninja, you love a woman. Let's just be honest. Oh, girl, she's making excuses after excuses. And it seems like Uche, like she's afraid of Uche Kipamuzi. The way Minangwana Ngakon, I feel like Oam is actually afraid of Uche Kipamuzi, mainly because of she knows Guti. Lomuntulo, if I actually say something wrong, there's a highly possibility Guti, she will sue me. And another thing that I actually realized is the fact that the way she's so refusing to actually upload that video. Yes, we saw the video. Uguti is there. She already made the video and she put it on private, right? But now she realized, Uguti, there's something that she said on that video of which is not right. And she knows very well, Uguti, Ucheki Pamuta might use it to actually sue her. So she put it on private. She doesn't want to upload it. Yes, the excuse of AKA actually passed. Obviously, like, we lost AKA on that week. Obviously, Oami said, Uguti, uh, it was emotional moment for her and stuff like that. So she couldn't release the, the whole video and stuff like that. And she put 
recorded the, that video on private. And now that Ujeki Pamut is saying Uji, she's about to sue her, Ukel still continues to actually put that video on private. And I actually saw a, a comment on her official statement on her main channel. So the comment says, Uji, uh, how about you actually like re upload that video and then so that we can get notified when you actually upload it because of if you put it on private obviously we won't get like we won't get notified we'll see that video actually went live so um actually agreed on that statement and one thing that actually came to my mind is the fact that for her to actually agree uh, on this it means Uguzi, she can actually like redo that video by actually like recording that video and remove the things that she actually said on that first video so that are worth suing for so that you know like Ulona doesn't have a thing to actually sue her for guys let's just be honest guys let's just be, even if you're a ninja let's just be honest oh, oh I'm just actually afraid of Ucheki Pamut because of she knows very well Uguzi, uh she might get sued at this point but could make any so guys the way she's uh moving about this whole thing good she will upload the video we should wait for that video we've been waiting instead of getting that video we're busy getting statement we're busy uh she's busy telling people good they shouldn't actually bully her to actually upload that video it shows good like there's something that she's afraid of and trust me, obviously she's afraid of being sued and she knows very well Uguti Uu girl can afford lawyers. She's here talking about her being instantaneous. Why? Why don't you just upload a video and then end this whole thing? And guys, let's just be honest. Uo Am is actually clever by doing this whole thing. She knows very well good if she uploads a video regarding that uh Jiggy Pamutsu, people will actually watch and see good Utin Ayo. She actually uploaded three videos without that story time. And already obviously those videos are actually getting views and stuff like that. And people wanna hear Ugutu Utin Ale situation between Yana No No Jiggy Pamutsu. And obviously we are waiting for that story time. And obviously we wanna know Guzi like when Zagalani in between when Zagalani are we getting the story time and stuff like that. So if she continue making videos where she will actually mention Ujeki Pamuts, even if it's not that story time, obviously people will wanna know. We'll watch that video so that like we get updated with Gwen Zagalani. So she's very clever when it comes to this whole thing. She knows very well if she just released the state like the whole video uh afterwards that thing is actually over so for her to actually so for her to actually continue this whole drama and getting views and stuff like that she needs to actually like de like derail this whole uh video so that she can get views and stuff like that and that's very clever when it comes to her and you know good to oh i mean when it comes to money she doesn't play she will do anything that just to get views and just to get money obviously whenever she does that video people are watching and obviously there's a Tra like attraction towards her videos and there's money that it's actually she's getting out of those videos that she actually made so unlike when she actually like uh, upload that video and then people start watching yeah she might get a lot of views on that video mainly because of people like drama but that's the end of it so she was very strategic when it comes to this whole situation by doing three videos regarding Ujeki Pamuzi and not uploading the main story time mainly because of people will actually watch that uh, those videos that she actually like uh referred to as Ujeki Pamuzi and stuff like that and then she will they, they will get views so she's going to make money out of those three videos so you see how strategic she's very like she is and one thing about oh i mean she doesn't play when it comes to money guys let's just be honest but anyway that's my two cent opinion regarding this whole situation if you actually like this video make sure you actually give it a thumbs up and actually comment your own opinion regarding this whole situation on the comment section down below and if you're actually new here make sure you actually subscribe to this unfiltered fam honey as i always say what are you waiting for anything do subscribe so that you can become a member of this unfiltered fam honey i love you guys Bye.